Thank you so much, Mr. Gibson. It is now time to recognize our honorees. Women who, while soaring in STEAM careers, have dedicated themselves to cutting a pathway for our scholars and indeed all girls and women to follow. Here are our 2021 Women Who STEAM Award honorees. Our first honoree, Robin Brown. She fervently believes that all students deserve the opportunity to learn computer science and create technology. She feels that equitable access to learning computer science is a vital skill for success in a digital world. Developing equity in North Texas computer science education will lead to more diverse technology college graduates who are qualified for higher paying and more competitive jobs, which in turn creates a more diverse technology industry workforce. To back up her beliefs, Ms. Brown founded Bold Idea, a nonprofit here in Dallas that teaches coding and computer science through hands-on learning to elementary, middle, and high school students. She's changing the trajectory of what students believe they can do through mentorship and peer learning. I'm Robin Brown. I'm the CEO and founder of Bold Idea. Uh, as CEO, I'm responsible for our strategic direction and for building new corporate and school partnerships. Um, at Bold Idea, we help students discover computer science through hands-on learning and mentoring from industry professionals. Uh, by working with a mentor, they get experience being a coder, building new skills, and it's really putting them on a pathway to a career in technology. And we know from research and just experience you know, over the past six years with Bold Idea that having an encouraging mentor and having the chance to learn these skills can have a huge impact on a student's pathway to continuing that interest and even pursuing it as a career opportunity. So we connected the two. I had a, a large body of software engineers, programmers, other technologists who were passionate about coding, connecting that with students who had an early interest. And from there, Bold Idea was born. And we developed a weekly mentoring program where mentors would work with students for two hours every week throughout the school year, and then every year beyond that. And they would continue to you know, create exciting coding projects. It might be a mobile app, a website, a video game, a machine learning program, whatever the student dreamed up, their bold idea. They had a supportive mentor and skill development to help them create it. It has been intimidating to spend the first decade of my career in the software industry, seeing that often I'm the only woman in that room and at the table. But what's really helped me is to remember what I bring to the table, that I alone bring. The skills and experiences that I have are needed by the people I'm working with and the partners that I'm working with. You know, we've got a diversity issue in the technology industry right now. You know, it's dominated by men. So when half of our population is solving problems that are for the entire world, then, you know, we have a very huge disconnect. You know, we're missing Half the population is not getting, you know, problems solved through technology because of that. Our world benefits when all women have a place and a seat at the table. When all women have a role in technology, we all win. Our world is built on technology. Computer code is the building blocks for the technologies all around us. So increasingly, we're going to be depending on technology to solve our biggest world problems. And to the young girls who have an interest in technology, your ideas are exciting and they're going to change the world. You are unstoppable. 